It's a trogan. Okay. What? <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to Bike Hike Fani. Okay, today I'm here in Hako and uh, I've got a surprise. Some of my YouTube viewers have come all the way to Costa Rica. <laughs> and I'm fortunate that I got to meet them. And Kelly and I have been doing a few hikes with them this week. And the really cool thing about Jim and Kristen is that they are huge birders. I've been learning a ton of stuff from them in the last few hikes that I've been on and hopefully today they can teach you something about birds here in Costa Rica. We're starting the hike out on the Miro Trail and we're going to be heading over to Cerro Fresco going through one of the secret trails up there. I'm not going to tell you the exact location. Yeah, and uh, <laughs> yeah, hopefully we see a lot of cool plants, wildlife and of course birds. Let's go! <laughs> Begonias here are in bloom right now. They're all over on the trail. These are Begonia multinervia. If you've seen them before in my videos. Really big eye. Oh yeah. It was a tinamou. Yeah, yeah. I think that I was a tinamou. Remember we did hear this little tinamou here. Yep. So the tinamou have really big eyeballs. Tinamous are solo. Okay, Jim has just spotted a riverside wren. Uh, they'll have a kind of a really rusty back of them. Uh -huh. They're really pretty. Is it black and with white stripes underneath? I I, uh, I can see it striping. Oh, he just came up. I think he came up here. Oh yeah, I see him now. He's hopping around. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, good eye. Good eye. Well, I was really looking at the flowers and then I noticed the butterfly. It's almost like a fern, but but it's a vine. Mm. She just touches it, eh? That's okay. It's highly toxic, but it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Rubs it on her face. <laughs> I hope you don't pay for that. Okay, I've just come across a flower from the balsa tree. I can't really film it right now. I don't know where it is. There's just too many trees here, but I'll insert a photo here for you guys. These are trees that are commonly used for woodwork and they grow in Central America, other parts of the world as well. They're actually pollinated in the daytime by capuchin monkeys, kinkajous, but they're kind of cool. They live to be about 30 to 40 years old and they can reach heights of 30 meters. But anyway, here's a bloom that's fallen off the tree and they turn this beautiful orange rust color after they've fallen. They've spotted a bird and they're telling me that the bird's nest is down here. Oh, it's building its nest. It's got nesting material. It's sitting on that root right now. It's super green. Super green. Yeah. He's actually weaving a nest right now. Where did he? he had nest oh, there I see him now. He's flown away. So could it? He Kelly, lands on this root thing a lot. Kelly's here. right. The female mannequin. Oh, there he is. You can probably get him on video or get her on video coming back. And I'm gonna try. Mm. He did just come here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there it is. It's just got a little tiny stick right now. It's about that long. Like it must just oh, fit in there so nicely he's, somewhere, you know? Oh. He got another little stick about this long this time. In. I wouldn't want 
to go down there. It would yeah, suck if we, bit. well, not so bad if you had the camera going, but if we <laughs> landslided down there. Oh, it would get it on, get it on footage, camera. We all died, probably. Shocking. Yeah. Shocking YouTube content. On, on lost camera. Four birders <laughs> go missing on Miro. <laughs> I, I think this is next year's Halloween uh, yeah. story. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you guys will have to come back for that. <laughs> Up on the tree up above, right there. Green head. Yeah. Oh, is that a garter? Wow, garter? oh, that's amazing. <laughs> that's a garter. I, garter yeah. Right? He's calling right now, yeah. Birders. Birders on the trail. Okay, we've just spotted a bat falcon up in this tree. Hopefully Jim can send me a photo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> yeah, it's yeah, I think it was. Yeah, I don't know. I know we noticed that. I hear some oh. morpha. I hear some morpha. I almost caught him. Oh. Come back. Yeah, he does. He's like, I can't hear him. Oh, it's beautiful. So how long have you guys been birding for? We went to Australia because we actually started like marking down the birds that we saw. Oh. <laughs> so we could remember, good thing we did. And uh, and then I go, they just sort of carried on into Ontario. We always were looking at birds. Uh-huh. But we'd only be able to identify like really obvious ones, you know, like okay. Baltimore Orioles. And, but now we Mm -hmm. Almost in Ontario. Yeah. Anyway. He knows them by call. Like he can just hear them. So now so. I do like bird counts by year, right? Okay. So in the summertime, you can't really see them, you know. But if you hear They're them, all hidden, you but you can hear them, so yeah. you can hear counts. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah. What's your favorite bird? Chickadees. They're boring. Chicken. No, I love chicken. No, no, chickadees. Chickadees. Oh. Not chickens. Chick chickens. I heard wrong. Yeah, chickadees. I love, I love chickens. Okay, too. I was like, that's Probably an odd bird, bird to like, bird. but I have hearing problems. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite bird? I still love macaws. Two so, yeah. hands. Yeah. Oh. And cardinals. Oh, yeah, cardinals. Yeah, in North America. Yeah. yeah. I wish we had them here. What's our yeah. favorite Costa Rican bird? Yeah, mot mots are pretty spectacular, yeah. but I don't know are what spectacular. macaws are spectacular. I never get tired of macaws. Yeah. Is there something you're hoping to see that you have not seen here yet? Yeah, those mannequins do their left hand. <laughs> Long-tailed mannequin. We've seen them, but not very well. Pheasant cuckoos. Huge and wild. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I've ever seen them. Eventually it catches off. Yeah, we've seen yeah. Off. yeah, we've seen Quetzal. They are beautiful. Though. They are. Quetzal, I guess they should. I don't know, quetzal, quetzal, yeah. potato, potato, potato. <laughs> it's right over there. <laughs> hear it? Oh yeah, I hear it. <laughs> it's a trogan. Okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> The best thumbnail ever. <laughs> Dead cicada. Oh, that's cool. These are the shells. They've uh -huh. just come out of the ground from their 17 year. <laughs> 17 year? Mm, sucking. There are 17 year cicadas. We don't know what these yeah, are. Yeah, we don't know. But in the States? They might have a quicker Seriously? Turnaround. There are 17, yeah, yeah they, they only come. The See. They come out for like the time to move yeah. and then they Basically die. Basically die, yeah. It's so sad. They're underground that whole time. That frog is going. Oh, this is a cicada carcass. <laughs> Are there more over there? Carcass. Here, they must have just like tapped. <laughs> like they're everywhere. Like yeah, they're everywhere. Like they're everywhere. This is an incredible pretty. Yeah. It's so pretty. It is. I love the shape. Roots are awesome. Mm -hmm. I love the color. I know. I know. That's great. It's almost like a coppery sheen. Yeah, yeah it is. It's 
weird. That's really cool. I wonder what it is. Yeah. It's so flowy and wavy. Pretty. Pretty leaf. Yeah, Monstera panati partita. This is a juvenile form. And then way up there, we've got some more mature leaves. That's beautiful, that one. Yeah. Oh, wow, that is beautiful. So that's a, that's a young one of them? Yeah. Oh, wow. Beautiful spot. How about the difference between a turkey vulture and a black vulture? Yeah, tell, tell the viewers. So there goes the black vulture. Black vultures have, you can sort of see through their wings when you look up at them, we call them windows. Okay. So black vultures have windows on the ends of their wings and turkey vultures have windows all along their wings. Yeah. That's how you tell. Interesting. And uh, you can't see their heads. trogans, what did you teach me about trogans today? Okay, so apparently they have a different colored ring around their eye. Eye ring. I thought it was just the eye. So you have to look at their but breast it's an color. Eye ring. <laughs> and their tail pattern. Okay. And their eye ring color. And that'll tell you what it is in your book. Cool. So now we're just gonna take a break and enjoy the view. We're trying to see some butterflies because this is a really great spot. They love this bush over here. What Jim just attracted. Wow. He That's stinks so bad that he attracted a stink bug. <laughs> I don't know that it's a stink bug. I know. I'm just, I'm just wow. No, it's really cool. It's got like really cool colored uh, things at the back. <laughs> Look at it from this side. From the other side. Really yeah. weird. It's Hello, wild. buddy. Most of it just passed out. Side. <laughs> <laughs> Left side only. <laughs> We're all still alive. Uh, yeah. We've made it. All right. Yeah, we've made it. So we had a really great morning. We went birding for several hours, saw tons of species. I don't remember what they all are, but Kristen and Jim are going to help me after this video and uh, give me a list of all the birds that we saw. So I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. 
And if you guys like this content, do me a huge favor. Just hit the like button and go and subscribe to my channel. Having said that, I wish you guys a very nice day and we'll see you on the next one. Pura Vida. Pura Vida. Very funny. <laughs> First person who finds something I, wins. Okay. <laughs> 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 very funny. <laughs>